Hello everyone out there in YouTube land and welcome back to my channel as I film on a slant because I can't get my camera to go correctly. Anyway, I'm back with the second Bath and Body Works semi-annual sale haul. Yay! Okay, so today is June 11th. It's Sunday. And now the uh, Bath and Body Works, the Bath and Body Works, now Bath & Body Works has got the Tutti Dolce line on sale for 75% off. So if you like the Tutti, Tutti, Tutti Dolce line, um, now is a good time to go and get yourself some. I'm trying to find what I did with my receipt. Oh, it's on the table. Okay, hold on. Okay, so anyway. I bought some stuff. I used my $10 off a 40 coupon, the one that I got in the mail because the one that was on Retail Me Not expired and now the coupon on there is 20% off of 25, something like that. Okay, so I got a whole bunch of stuff. Let me show you what I bought. Let me tell you what I paid and that'll be that. Hmm. Okay, so these shower gels with the coupon came out to $2.33 each. Uh, some of them, well, I'm going to show you what I have to give as a gift to somebody, but $2.33 a piece. So I got the Tutti Dolce Pink Peony Cream, Pink Peony Cream, whichever you prefer. This, I'm, I'm trying to get a good thumbnail. I never get a good thumbnail. Okay, so I picked up three of the Tutti Dolce Pink Peony Cream. Okay, so this says, um, I really feel like I'm on a slant. <laughs> That's not what it says, but the camera is on a slant. Anyway, so this says, Blushing Peony Blossom, Pink Currant, and White Amber Dipped in Nectar. Now, I'm not normally a fan of sweet scents, but I completely, like, I, I only shop during the semi-annual sale, unless it's something I really, really need, like wool flowers or something. I usually have enough body care to last me, so I completely skipped over this line when it came out. It smells... It smells really good. I'm glad I bought extra. It's really sweet. It's like, um... But in a good way. It's like a sugary. I want to say a rose scent. It's peony, which is kind of like rose. Mmm. It's like a sugary floral. It's really, really nice. Sugary floral with. I don't know what else is in there, but it is really good. So I got three of those. You know what? I may not gift these. I was going to gift one of these. I was going to gift a set, which I'm going to show you. But I don't know if I can part with it now. $2.33 a piece. So then, also with the shower gel, I got one of the Sweet Lemon Buttercup. And this says Juicy Meyer Lemon, Creamy Buttercup Petals, and Fluffy Meringue Sprinkled with Sugar. It does smell like a lemon meringue. But it also has this really nice soapiness to it. So it's like, it's not, it's not super, super bakery. It does have like um, a sense of, of like clean in it, like a freshness, not completely syrupy sweet. Mmm, so good. You know what? If this, I now I'm kicking myself that I didn't buy more, but I wanted to stick to my my forty dollar budget. And then I picked this up, which this was the least um, least favorite of mine. When I first smelled it, it kind of made me nauseous. I know a lot of people really love this one, like this is their favorite, but for me, mm, so this is White Mocha Kiss, and this says Rich Vanilla Mocha and Coconut Orchid wrapped in marshmallow cream. It 
something about it is is something about it is a little nauseating. I don't know. It almost has like a sour scent to it, like a like a marshmallow that went bad. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. Because I, I was at my, um, I wasn't at my $40 mark. I kept adding stuff and adding stuff and it didn't hit $40. So I had to keep putting stuff on. So I had not intended to go back and get more. But I was like, it was the, either this or the praline one. And I'm thinking maybe I should have gotten the praline one. That's the only one that I didn't get. This is a little, uh, I don't know how I feel about it. Okay, so those were all the shower gels. Now, they had the Creamy Body Wash, which is originally $14.50 on sale for, uh, with the coupon, $2.71. And these were going really fast. So I got, let me start at the beginning. So I got the pink Peony Cream Creamy Body Wash. And of course, somebody squeezed this, and it was not me. So I'm going to have to clean that up. I hate when people over squeeze and touch and finger the stuff. Um, then I got a um, sweet lemon buttercup. This one somebody did not squeeze. See? It's normal. Mm. And then I also picked up the white mocha kiss. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. So then I also picked up um, a body cream and this was originally $13. So this was $2.43. And I got this in the golden honey praline. Huh. I meant to get this in the pink peony cream. And being that it's pink, which it shouldn't be, I got the praline one instead, by accident. Okay. Creamy caramel and praline musk drizzled in golden honey. I know I'm not going to be able to smell this because I have so much crap on me that I put in this, on me in the store. It's okay. I have to say, it smells, it smells a little coconutty, to be honest. I'm not nuts about it. So what I was gonna, okay, let me show you the rest of it and then I'll tell you what I'm gifting to someone. Okay, so then I picked up one soap. The soap was um, $3 and then with the coupon, it came out to, I don't know. I don't see a $3 thing on here. Did she not ring up the soap? Oh, here, the soap. It says $6.50. And then 50% off is $3. Okay, I got it. So the soap was $2.43. So I got this one soap. I got shades of summer suntan because you know you guys know that i'm all about the suntan copper tone smell if i wish they bring back that suntan candle again um mm, it does smell like copper tone but it has something else in it it's almost like a citrusy scent it's almost like copper tone with lemon or some kind of citrus but anyway so this says shades of summer summer suntan bask in the sun and let yourself shine i don't know if i'm crazy about the i mean the packaging is nice i guess but the i don't know something about the font and why is there a period at the end of that shades of summer period why that why is that there that's not a sentence grammar people grammar this is oh god do they have to 
put a story? It says, every summer has a story. Bring yours to life with a fragrance scented with warm sandalwood, coconut water, and sparkling lemon. I told you I smelled citrus. I knew it. So I picked this up, hoping it would smell like sunscreen. I don't know if it will or not. Then when I was at the counter, I wanted to get one of these sprays. I don't know why I buy these sprays. Well, yes, I do. I stopped getting the pocket backs because I just don't like them. I feel like they're slimy for some reason. I don't know. Just, I prefer the spray. I bought a spray last semi-annual sale in Sweet Pea. I had it in my bag until the label literally just, the picture literally rubbed off and the label was white and I didn't go through it. But I like, if I'm going to have antibacterial in my purse, for the times that I do need it, I figured, I'm, oh, my camera's going to die. i got to go through this bit. So I got the Bermuda Plumeria Sunrise, which smells really nice, as opposed to the coconut and other stuff. So with the coupons and everything, all this stuff came out to $32.25. The thing that I was going to gift, because my mother said she needed a gift for someone, was going to be a set of the Pink Peony Cream, the pink penny cream um, body wash thing here and a Tutti Dolce body cream which it was all supposed to be the same fragrance but it's not because I am an idiot and I got the body cream in the golden honey praline so she'll just have to figure it out the woman that's going to get it so this gift here is under ten dollars now I asked them if they had those um, what do you call it um, the see-through bags with the tie and the stuff I think I have ones left over but they didn't have any so I said can I have like a small bag with some gingham paper so they gave me a small bag I said don't give it first she was going to give me the one with the semi-annual cell duck on it and I was like no I don't want this woman who my mother is actually gifting this stuff to to think we're cheap so she gave me some gingham paper and she gave me the Bath and Body Works thing did I lose my battery uh, okay I'm really running out of battery so yeah, so I have that, and that's going to be that, and she'll get that stuff, and I think I should have gotten more Tutti Dolce. I feel like I didn't get enough, which is, is weird, because it's just weird. Anyway, yeah. The other stuff that was on sale, still 75% off, was the Lemon Cello, but they didn't have any shower gel left. The Tahiti Island Dream, they didn't have any left, um, but they did have the, the moisturizing body wash and the Japanese cherry blossom and warm vanilla sugar. And I do believe they had some moonlit path, but they had no thousand wishes, wishes left. And then I just wanted to say something really quick about the berry waffle cone candle that everybody's smelling and saying is so amazing. I smelled it and to me it smelled exactly like summer boardwalk. And I checked the dust cover and I checked the bottom of the candle and it was indeed berry waffle cone, but it smelled like summer boardwalk to me. So I did not buy it because I already have summer boardwalk. So that's the end of this video. Remember to comment, rate, subscribe. I will see you in another video, hopefully. Goodbye everyone out there in YouTube land.